Woo! Lil Heretic video. Brandon spraying. I'm burning. I'm tired. <laughs> All right, gang bangers, I know you didn't come to see a poor pastor stay in school. This is, wait a minute. I'm a thesis away from a doctoral degree. Don't go to school. Who knows? I'm a poor pastor doing poor pastor labor. I'm a poor pastor in many ways. You don't care about this. Let's go on and check out the boat. What's up, heretics? We are back, and um, I am happy to report the boat is finished. This is the last Carolina Skiff restoration video you're going to get because I am done. I actually took the uh, cable, control cable, off of the old motor and just stuck it on here. My new cable, because I've short change I only ordered one after the other ones were too short they're in the boat if you want to buy these just give me a call these are regularly seventy dollars I may even sell them for about fifty they're brand new uh, but let me show you what I've done let me show you how I done it and uh, you guys will be able to see just where we're at on the skiff All right, players, you're going to see that nice floor. See that? Yeah. And now, guys, I ended up having to drill holes. See that? That's 5,200 right there. I drove, had to drill three holes, put three screws in there. 5,200 is down in there. That sucker is... Can I say that on TV? I don't know. It's YouTube. That is down. You can't show deer on YouTube, but you can show skin and sex. How about that? Don't you love America? Um, but that's 5,200 to end. Now, this floor is dry deck, and it was expensive. And I just want to show you really easy to put together. See that? that those knobs right there there just go into the holes these uh, other side goes into those holes i cut this with um snips and that's how we trimmed right around all of this and the only thing i don't like is i attach this with the mind that i was going to push that up in there i forgot to do it after before i drilled this down let me show you in the in that and then you see all this in the back lots of wires guys lots of wires we're gonna go ahead and put our transom saver down there uh i i feel like this it'd be hard for somebody to fish on this side out the back but you should have room over there to fish out the back got the cushion for the top gonna get the cushion there all the wires look at that light switch voila light switch is good you hear the pump pump is good then we're gonna put the uh helix five which was on our kayak we're just gonna get a scotty mount put that scotty mount right up there and be able to see that as we drive just like that guys um really like that then we got the cooler a cooler really happy with that it's an igloo marine cooler in there and then more dry deck and then on the front those are led lights 
all hooked up pretty and um then in here now i tried to use a car battery that my wife had bought for an old jeep and um the alternator must have been bad and it sucked it out anyways we got our fuse box there we got our batteries we got uh venting in there for our batteries that's our cranking battery bought that at AutoZone 74 dollars and um that'll be our trolling motor battery we hadn't decided where we're going to put the trolling motor yet uh i don't really want to put it up there i'd rather probably mount it back here but i don't know if i'll have enough room here to mount it and then we don't know how we'll mount it so that'll be another day i'm not worried about a trolling motor right now because you know why it's um fall and we like to move so that is the skiff guys this is it it is ready let me show you the controls over here all right guys suzuki motor there's our controls really like where it's at listen they they sent these spacers so i was able to go right off the side of that spacers this thing shifts really really good bam you're in four you're in neutral now you're in reverse Brum. reverse is a little tight and i just think it's the cord it's or the, not the cord but the uh, cable so you can see right there i'm not gonna be in full blast reverse anyway i'm gonna get about right there and be good and then the key uh, and the emergency switch we got the cables down i am going to try to keep these cables about like that right there uh so that it just makes it a little bit easier uh back here and then i've got panduit straps on all these cables but you should have a little bit of room here to put two poles fish out the back and then one person two people can fish out the front all right gang i'd be lying if i didn't tell you i feel pretty accomplished right now um <laughs> This boat has been a lot of work, and it's been, uh, what, eight months? I took some time uh, planting my garden, did um, a lot of other things. We got COVID, got through COVID, uh, spent the summer just really trying to catch up on work and vacation and all of that stuff. We're done. Next time you see me, I'm gonna be on this thing. We're gonna we gotta take it to the lake, see if it floats, see what we get, and um, hopefully that hopefully it does. If it doesn't, uh, we're gonna put a for sale sign on it, and we're gonna sell it really cheap. Just get our our money back out of what we paid for that motor. So. <laughs> it'll float. It'll float. I'm not worried about that. I've patched it and patched it and patched it. Listen, guys. Hey, if you go back and watch the other videos, see everything we've done, you have questions, feel free to ask me. I don't really know. I kind of looked on YouTube for everything else, and um, I'm pretty excited because this is a really nice boat. Um, I'm poor, so poor guys are happy taking other people's trash and making it their dream, right? Uh, love the boat. We're going to get it out and see. We might have to get planers. We don't really know what we're going to have to get yet, but we're excited. I'm excited. I'm going to take you out next Thursday. If it doesn't rain, I'm going to be on the lake. Me and the boss are going to go take it out, see if it floats, see if there's any water coming in anywhere, and see what we need to repair. And uh, just a little punch list stuff. But right now, all the major stuff's done. Tags are on. I need a fire extinguisher, and we're getting out. And then we're going to take those ACC crappy sticks and go catch some crap. Hey! Hey! Like, comment, subscribe. Appreciate you watching and uh, hope to see you out on the adventure.